heard that song in a number of different venues and versions and arrangements by all kinds of different artists. But the song essentially says the same thing as several other hymns, close to thee or near to the heart of God. There are just some difficulties in adequately expressing the, the meaning behind the song in such a way that people can practically grasp it. A closer walk with the Lord. What does that mean, a closer walk with the Lord? Well, I believe the psalmist expresses it in Psalm 73, 28, but it is good for me to draw near to God, to draw near to God. And in the New Testament, we read, draw nigh unto God, draw, draw nigh or near to the Lord. And the rest of the Psalm says, I have put my trust in the Lord God that I may declare all thy works. So think about it this way. What is nearest and dearest to the heart of God himself. Well, I believe his son. I believe his word. I believe those that have trusted Christ. Uh, I believe these are the things and the ones that are nearest to the heart of God. And so we should draw near or nigh to God by drawing nigh, having a close walk with the Lord Jesus, just a closer walk, by having a more dedicated a commitment to reading, memorizing, and, and uh, practicing the Word of God. Uh, a, a greater commitment to sharing the good news of salvation with others so that they might come to be saved and become part of God's great family. Those are the things that are nearest to his heart and dearest to him. Those are the things and the people who should be nearest and dearest to us. It's not a matter of our pretending or trying uh, with some great human effort to, uh, to be more holy or to appear uh, more sanctified or sanctimonious, but instead just determining from the Word of God what's near God's heart, and then we draw nigh or near to those things and those people. Let's pray. Father, I pray just now that you will help us to have a desire to please you. And Lord, give us an intense love for the word and for the lost souls in this world and for the Lord Jesus Christ and, and to seek his pleasure. Lord, I pray that today we might be Christians through and through by our life, by our words, by our attitudes. And help us, Lord, to see those areas in which we need to draw nigh, draw near to you. With our heads bowed and eyes closed, perhaps you've never been saved. Would you call on Jesus Christ right now to come in your heart and save you? Just pray something like this. Dear Lord, please come in my life. Save me right now. I need a Savior. I want Jesus to come in my heart, be my personal Savior, and take away my sins. And if you've prayed that prayer and meant it, would you just let us know? And we'd love to rejoice with you. And if you uh, are leading souls to Christ, please share that with us. Right now, let's pray for someone in the hospital or someone on a bed of affliction recuperating from an operation or a procedure. Let's pray for them right now. Lord, I pray for the sick, for the needy, for the hurting. Also, Lord, we pray for those that have spiritual and, and mental and financial and relational issues, vocational issues. Help them all, each one. Protect folks on the road right now. Keep your hand of protection and care and love upon them and help us to be near and to walk close to you and to your great heart in Jesus' name. Amen. Just a closer walk with thee. Granted, Jesus is my plea.
close to the Lord today.